The Australian Computer Society is an association for information and communications technology professionals with over 26,000 members Australia-wide. According to its constitution, its objects are, "...to advance professional excellence in information technology," and "...to promote the development of Australian information and communications technology resources." The ACS was formed on 1 January 1966 from five state-based societies. It was formally incorporated in the Australian Capital Territory on 3 October 1967. Since 1983 there have been chapters in every state and territory. The ACS is a member of the Australian Council of Professions, Professions Australia, the peak body for professional associations in Australia. Internationally, AXE is a member of the International Professional Practice Partnership (IP3), Southeast Asia Regional Computer Confederation, International Federation for Information Processing, and the Sole Accord. The AXE is also a member organization of the Federation of Enterprise Architecture Professional Organizations (FEAPO), a worldwide association of professional organizations which have come together to provide a forum to standardize, professionalize, and otherwise advance the discipline of enterprise architecture. Architecture. Activities The ACS operates various chapters, annual conferences, special interest groups, and a professional development program. Members are required to comply with a code of ethics and a code of professional conduct. Topic. Extent of representation The ACS describes itself as, "...the professional association for Australia's information and communication technology sector," and, "...Australia's primary representative body for the ICT workforce." But industry analysts have questioned this based on the small percentage of IT professionals who are ACS members. The issue has been discussed in the press since at least 2004, and in 2013 the Sydney Morning Herald wrote that, "...the ACS aggressively seeks to control the important software engineering profession in Australia, but less than 5% of the professional IT workforce belongs to the ACS." The ACS Foundation came up with a slightly higher figure, depending on the data used to calculate the number of ICT professionals in Australia, however, ACS membership represents approximately 6.5% of the total. Presidents The Australian Computer Society elects its national president every two years, who serves as the leader of the society. Some of the most recent presidents include Johan Ramasandara, 2018 current, Anthony Wong, 2016 2017, Brenda Ainsley, 2014 2016, Nick Tate, 2012 2014, Kumar Parakala, 2008 2010. Philip Argy, 2006 to 2008. Edward Mandler, 2004 to 2006. Topic: Young IT. The Young IT Professionals Board of the Australian Computer Society provides a voice for young IT professionals and students, as well as a range of services and benefits for members. Currently Young IT organises and runs a bi-annual YIT international conference and other events such as local career days, soft skills and technical seminars, networking opportunities and social events e.g. Young IT in the pub in each of the Australian states. The most recent Young IT conference was held in Melbourne in 2014. Topic: Publications. Information Age is the official publication of the ACS. In February 2015, Information Age became an online only publication. Peer reviewed research publications of the ACS include Journal of Research and Practice in Information Technology, Conferences in Research and Practice in Information Technology, 
Australasian Journal of Information Systems The Digital Library contains free journal articles and conference papers. Related organizations Other Australian computer associations AUUG, now deregistered Linux Australia Lugs in Australia SAGEO Institute of Analytics Professionals of Australia IAPA, incorporating business data analytics, business intelligence, data mining and related industries Australian Software Innovation Forum, encourages collaboration and cooperation in Java EE and associated technologies Topic. Special interest groups Special interest groups of the ACS are connected to each state branch with some SIGs of the same or similar name occurring in a number of states, depending on local interest, and include, architects, software quality assurance, women in technology, business requirements analysis, enterprise capacity management, enterprise solution development, free open source software, information security, IT management, project management, service-oriented computing, web services, consultants and contractors, IT security Security, PC Recycling, Curry SIG, Information Technology in Education, Robotics, E-Commerce, IT Governance, Software Engineering and Cloud Computing. A recent addition is the Green ICT Group on Computers and Telecommunications for Environmental Sustainability. In 2007 the Telecommunications Society of Australia was absorbed into the Australian Computer Society as the Telecommunications Special Interest Group. Topic education and certification The ACS runs the Online Computer Professional Education Program for postgraduate education in subjects including, green ICT strategies, new technology alignment, business, strategy and IT, adaptive business intelligence, project management, managing technology and operations. CPEP uses the Australian developed Moodle course management system and is delivered via the web. The Diploma of Information Technology (DIT) is equivalent to one academic year of a Bachelor of Information Technology at several universities. It has 8 compulsory subjects: Systems Analysis, Programming, Computer Organization, Data Management, OO Systems Development, Computer Communications, Professional Practice and Systems Principles. The ACS also certifies IT professionals at two levels: the Certified Professional and the Certified Technologist. Each certification level has a minimum level of experience and also required ongoing CPD certified professional development hours of learning each year. In 2017 the ACS launched a cybersecurity specialization within the certification framework. See also Skills framework for the information age